Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine. Fine, teacher. Okay, pretty good. So, Jose Arturo, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. Thank All you. All right, you? that's nice. I'm doing well, thanks. How was the weekend? Um, pretty good. Okay, that's nice. And how about yesterday? Did you go to the cemetery? Yes. You did? Okay, that's great. Jasmine, how are you? Hi, teacher, and you? Excellent, I'm doing well, thanks. So how was the weekend? And it was very busy, but because um, I I work at, um, on on Sunday, um, I I have a classes um, on Saturday. Oh, it was pretty busy. Yes. So, what do you study? Yeah. Um. Um, a master's degree. Oh, wow. That's great. So that's pretty interesting. Very nice. And Lorena, how are you, Lorena? Hi, Lisa. Excellent. How was the weekend? I was doing amazing. I was... I was... Irony? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Pretty tiring. A lot of clothes to I take time to do that. Oh, okay. And how about yesterday? Did you go to the cemetery? No, because my parents died in. Oh, okay. Oh, yes, I get it. I went on um, Friday, Friday, Saturday, yeah, to go back. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, that's good. Good evening, Isabel. Hi, teacher. How's it going? How are you? I am great. Excellent. How was the weekend? Uh, wonderful. All right. That's excellent. That's nice. Hi, Mauricio. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. How's it going? Uh, nothing. It's my rest day. Today. Oh, okay. I didn't not work. You didn't uh, work. Today. I didn't work today. That's great. So you had a, a free day yesterday too, or yesterday? Yesterday too. Yes. yes. Oh. You have four days then, or did four you work days. on the weekend? I take four days, yes. Whoa, that's I great. A, a long day. <laughs> a very but long I, I, I will work, I will work the Saturday and Sunday. Oh, okay. All right, yes. that's nice. So what did you do today? Uh, nothing. Llevé a mis padres al médico. Uh, you took your parents to the doctor? To the doctor, yes. Um, and pay any bills. 
Okay. All right, that's good. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening, Karen. Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. And you? Very good. I'm doing well, thanks. Nice. How was the weekend, Karen? Oh, uh, fine. Okay. I will rest yesterday. Oh, you rested? Okay. That's nice. Did you go to the cemetery? No, no. I'm staying in the house. Okay. All right. That's great. And how about the platform, guys? Arturo, um, did you get the progress at the end? Um, I finished. You finished? And the platform, yes. But um, the real bars uh, are great. Oh, okay. So the platform hasn't updated. It's still as yes. you told me. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to ask about that tomorrow. So they can check. Can you help me? Yes, and then um, if you may have any screenshots or any pictures, that would help. Um, para los que vayan avanzando en la plataforma, los que aún no han terminado, si de pronto pudiera tomar screenshots o fotos para que si no nos marca el progreso, pues podemos preguntar, ¿verdad? Podemos consultarlo y pues así tenemos la prueba de que ya completamos. Aunque igual ya les habían informado que hemos estado teniendo problemas con la plataforma, entonces pues están ahí en eso, ¿verdad? Arreglando. Déjenme entonces consultar <coughs> mañana, Arturo, a ver qué me dicen. Perfecto. Eh, en, la, en la plataforma la barra final me aparece, no sé si está bien, pero aparece 100%, pero tiene una parte gris. Pero, pero, oh, en okay. reunión, perdón, pero en la reunión de inicio explicaron esto, que la última barra era gris. Yo a lo oh, que sí, yo sí. poniendo morado, rojo, cuando, como la persona fue explicando y decía que la última era gris. Ah, uh, ok, perfecto. Sí, eh, le mando captura o ya no, teacher? Si gusta, eh, más, si chequeamos y nos aseguramos, pero sí, eso también les iba a comentar. Lo que importa al final es el porcentaje que nos muestra en la última barra, ah, okay. porque ese ya es el promedio yes. de todo el curso, de todo lo que usted ha hecho en cada una de las secciones y en los exámenes. Entonces, eso sería lo más importante. Eh, sí, si gustan, mándenme de todos modos la captura ahí para chequear que todo esté bien. Y pues, sí, es así como dice Lorena, tienes razón. Check out. Porque la primera vez que la pinta, Pero, hasta la, hasta la, la cuarta era en roja. Después yes. decía que la sexta la, venía el examen de promedio, después decía que era una ocre y después decía el examen final gris. Y va a estar con ustedes. Pero, va, eh... Sí está, pero lo que tiene la barra es que está a la mitad roja. La no es completamente de... gris, está, está hasta, hasta la mitad de rojo. ¿Y el porcentaje, Ajá. Arturo, no se recuerda cómo está? 100. Mm. 100. Ok, entonces sí, mándeme ahí la captura y yo mañana consulto para que salgamos de duda, ¿verdad? Ok. Ok. So, good evening, Joshua. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Very well. Okay, that's nice. How was the weekend? Uh, fine. Just fine? Okay. Did you have to work or did you rest? Yes, it? yes. No, uh, I went to work. Oh, you had to work. Okay. And how about the platform, Joshua? Have you been working? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, uh, finally. Okay. 
You're almost finishing. Okay. Almost that's, finish. That's nice. Good evening, Carla. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How are you? Uh, I'm fine, thank you. And you? How about you? I'm great, thanks. Good. So, how was the weekend? Uh, in the house. Okay. In the house only. All right. But good. In. Yes, you have you had some time to rest. Just do housework, I imagine, and maybe watch a movie or some TV. <laughs> yes, yes, movie uh, with my son. Okay, that's nice. Yes, yes. All right, so I think we may start with the class now. So let's see. So first of all, um, do you have any questions or any doubts about any of the topics or any of the exercises in the platform? Questions? No? No questions. Okay. All right, so let's start with this activity, which is called erase a word. So how does it go? Well, here I have a list of different verbs in the past, and we are going to practice their pronunciation. So first of all, let me read each of the verbs. So please listen and repeat. Listened. Listened. Studied. 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 Helped. 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 Painted. 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 Started. 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 Met. 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 Fixed. 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 Drop. 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 Wanted. 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 New. 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 Run. 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 Played. 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 Grot. 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 Took. 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 Bought. Belt. Bought. 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 Remember, we do not pronounce the the you, okay? We do not pronounce okay, that you, but. just but. So but. you should omit all of this, but, but. 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 Okay. So next one we have is broke. 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 Watched. Watched. What? Red. 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 Okay. So now I'm going to ask some people to read the verbs. So let me see. One by one, I'm going to show them. And then I'm going to select a person to read the verb. For example, this one, Arturo. Can you read it? Listen it. Okay, again, Arturo. Listen it. Listened. Repeat, please. Listen. Very Listen. good. Okay, next one, Lorena. Study. Studied. Very good. Okay, so that is what we are going to do. I am going to say a name of one of you, and then you have to read the verb that appears. Then um, be careful with the pronunciation because it should be correct. If it's not correct, then we're going to get back to the first verb. Voy diciendo okay. un nombre, voy mostrando uno de los verbos, vamos leyendo, pero cuidado con la pronunciación porque si la pronunciación es incorrecta, volvemos al primer verbo, ¿ok? So let's give okay. it a try. Okay. Let's, let's play. Let's see. Um, Laura, can you start? Listen it. Again, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't know. <laughs> okay, don't worry. So everybody repeat. Listen. 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 Okay, one more time, Laura. Listen. Excellent. Next one, Isabel. Estar. Can you repeat it, please? Estar. Studied. Studied. Okay, so Sorry. let's get back. Let's see. Ana Ruth, start, please. Listen. Great. Carla Enriquez. Studied. Okay, very good. Studied. Okay. Next one, Arturo. Helped. Very good. Lorena. Found. Again, Lorena. Found. That one is painted, painted, okay? So everybody repeat, painted. 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 Okay, so we start over, Mauricio, start. Listen. Okay, Lorena. Isabel. Help. Laura. Laura? Hola. Can you read this one? Thank you. Very good. Next one is for Arturo. Start. Okay, very good. Let's see. Ana Ruth? Met. Excellent. Karen. Fix it. Again, Karen? Fix it. Okay, that one is fixed. Fixed. Uh, fixed. Okay, okay, pretty good. Everybody repeat. Fixed. Fix. 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 Okay, fixed. so let's do it one more time. I need you to be attentive. Do it quickly, okay? So let's see the first one, Joshua. Listen. Isabel? Jasmine? Hand. Carla? Painted. Okay, painted. Lorena? Apple. Very good. Arturo? Met. Okay, Joshua? Fits. Isabel? Rob. Very good. Jasmine? Wanted. Great. Carla? Mm, no. New. Okay? New. Everybody Sorry. Repeat. It's fine. Don't worry. Everybody repeat. New. <laughs> New. 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 Okay. New. Let's just continue. Okay. Let's see. Mauricio, continue. Run. <laughs> okay. Next one, Joshua. Played. Great. Karen. Great. Broad. Very good. Laura. Yay. Look. All right. Anna Ruth. But. Okay. Just remember, we say but. Esa U no suena para nada, okay? But. 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 
But all right, pretty good. Lorena, next. No. Great. Arturo. Watch. Again, Arturo. Huh. Watch. Watched. Okay. Carla. Red. Excellent. Okay, pretty good. So everybody repeat. But. 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 New. 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 Listened. Listened. Fixed. 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 All right. So let's continue. So today we are going to make a review of the simple past. So we already know that for the affirmative sentences, we change the verb to the past, right? And we have two different kinds of verb, two big groups of verbs, the regular verbs and the irregular ones. For the regular verbs, we need to add ed, d or ied, depending on the rules. And for the irregular verbs, we need to change their forms. Here we have some examples. We played basketball last Saturday. Next one, let's see. Joshua, can you help me to read, please? My sister studied a lot for the Epson. Thank you. Next one, Arturo. Sam ate some cake on his birthday. Thank you. Mauricio, help me with the next example. I, I drank some hot chocolate. Thank you. And that was it. Okay, so remember, in the affirmative, what we need to take into account is that we have to change the verbs. En el afirmativo siempre, siempre cambiamos el verbo porque recuérdese que si no le agrega el ed o en el caso de los irregulares, si no lo cambia, pues estaríamos hablando en presente, ¿verdad? Si en lugar de decir Sam ate, digo Sam eat, entonces sigo hablando en el presente. No estoy diciendo lo que en realidad quiero decir, right? So always remember for the regular verbs, add ed, d or ied, like played, studied and for the regular verbs we have different forms right yeah. like ate drunk okay so now we are going to practice by changing the sentences to the past so i'm going to read <clears throat> sorry let me just take some water <clears throat> okay so i'm going to tell you a sentence in the simple present and you have to change it to the past. For example, the first one, it says, my father goes to the gym. Change it to the past, please. My father went, went to the gym. Exactly, my father went to the gym. Okay, very good. So let's see, Arturo, this one is for you. She loves to play basketball. She loves to play basketball. Great. So we change the verb loves for loved. Loved to play basketball. Thank you, Arturo. Mauricio, next one's for you. It says, she thinks he is handsome. She thinks he is handsome. She did. Um, the past of think is? Think. Uh, I'm sorry. What's the past I of think? I don't got it. Okay, let me just write it for you, okay? Oh, yeah, thanks. So it goes like, she thinks he is handsome. There you are. Handsome. She did thinks he is handsome. So what's the past of think? Uh, 
Talk. 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 Okay. Okay. She she did talks. He is handsome. Okay. Just remember, in the case of the affirmative sentences, we do not use did. No utilizamos did a menos que estemos trabajando ah, yeah. con el verbo do, ¿verdad? So, in okay. this case, she we talks, say she thought. Mm -hmm. She talks, he's, he's handsome. Okay. She thought he is handsome or you could even change that is to was. She thought he was handsome. Could be. En ese caso podemos utilizar cualquiera de las dos, is o was también. Okay. She okay. thought he is handsome or okay. she thought he was handsome. Do you know the meaning of handsome? handsome? Okay. By the way, do you Thanks know the meaning it's... of handsome? Guapo. Yes. Guapo. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Okay. Next one. Thanks. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see, Lorena. <laughs> I run at the park. Run. I run at the park. Exactly. I run. Run, right? I run at the park. I run at the park. Yeah, it sounds similar. Solamente que les decía el, el pasado es eh, con una más marcada. Una que se pronuncia run. con la boca abierta, right? Run, run. 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 Okay, very Run. good, Lorena. Let's Run. see, next sentence is for Karen. Karen, we play okay. tennis. We play tennis. We played tennis. Excellent. Next one, Carla Enriquez. He writes an email. He wrote the email exactly he got an email okay Let's see Anna Ruth Anna Ruth he goes to the church he he went to the church excellent next one let's see Noemi I like ice cream I love ice cream. What's the past of like, Noemi? Can you repeat it, please? Again, Noemi, I like ice cream. Can you say it in the past? Like it. I like it. Ice cream. Okay, very good. Just the pronunciation, liked. Liked. Like. I liked ice cream. Excellent. Thank you, Noemi. Next one is for Jasmine. Jasmine. Let's see. We have they make the bed. They make the bed. Okay. Make. Made made uh -huh. they made uh, dinner. Oh, the they bed. Made. They made the bed. They, they made the bed. Okay, very good. All right, excellent. So always keep that in mind. You change the verb to talk about the past. Okay. So now to continue practicing, I am going to send you to the breakout rooms for you to talk about your weekend. So you're going to answer this question. What did you do last weekend? What did you do last weekend? So you may talk about um, everything you did, right? I went to... I went to Guatemala, right? Or I went to Sonsonate. I ate some pupusas. I visited my grandma. I went to a party. 
just whatever you did. And even if you stayed home, please try to keep on talking and mentioning the things you did. Like I ironed my clothes, I washed the dishes, I cleaned the house and everything you did, okay? Vamos a hablar del okay. fin de semana. Necesito, por favor, que eh, tratemos de mencionar tantas actividades como se pueda, de hablar tanto como podamos. Pues aunque se haya quedado en casa, habrán muchas cositas que hizo, ¿verdad? Si vio una película, si limpió, si hizo oficio, todo, todo lo que pueda mencionar, ¿ok? So let me just send you to the breakout room so you answer the question in pairs. And remember to pay attention to your classmate because when we come back, we are going to share what our classmate did. Okay? So let's okay. see. All right, so there you are. Please accept the invitation and talk about what you did on the weekend. Sure that. Okay. Why you did? Why you? Did, why did you the last weekend? Um, I went to my friends and cleaned my room, and then I watched a movie. Okay, and could you? Could you repeat me, please, for write um, any sentence? Mm -hmm. Okay. The first, first, you go. You went to your parent. My friends. Friends. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Isabel. This it. Mm-hmm. Visit his his friend. Uh huh. Okay, and another. Solamente. Um, I I cleaned my house. Yeah. And I played with my my son con mis hijos. Okay. Mm. And I I made a dress. Hice un vestido. En la máquina no sé cómo se dice. I don't know. That's okay, Anna Ruth. I made a dress. It's mm -hmm. fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, my turn. Okay. What did you do last weekend? Eh, quiero ver. No recuerdo. I was um, I was um my dog in the park okay i know you remember. went to the park yeah okay. i don't remember not he sleeping asleep 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 sleep sleep okay tears only okay Ah, uh, ahí está Laura. Hola, Laura. Oh, sí. Teacher también. Teacher. Bien <laughs> Hello, teacher. Hi, I'm here listening to you. <laughs> A little later, pero. <laughs> 
Ok. Laura, hola. Hola. Hola, Laura. Nos no va a contar qué hizo el fin de semana. Uh -huh. Este, que ver. I, I take a shower. I took a shower. Uh -huh. I, what? You were working uh -huh. too much? Yes. Well, I, I went to, I went to Cumbre de San Bartolo. I went to, to, to give, uh, to, to give, I, went. A, I went, yes, I went to, to oh. llevar, I don't know how to, do, how to say you that. To bring. To, to bring, okay, a DVD, the song one that lives there, and I was, a little, a little nervous because I, I never have seen in San Bartolo, in Cumbre de San Bartolo, but I, I, it was great. I, I went on 29A bus, 29A bus, and that's okay. Okay. Um, on, on, on Saturday. On Saturday. Saturday night. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, I Okay, so we're back. Let's see, let me hear about some of your weekends. Let's see, um, Jasmine, who were you working with? Uh, I work with Carla Maria Enrique. Okay, so tell me about Carla's weekend. Okay, um, Carla um, uh, clean. Uh, uh, her house. Okay. Uh, on, um, she visited to her parents on Saturday on Saturday night. Um. She uh, uh, eat, uh, ate. Ate. Sorry, repeat that, please, Jasmine. Mm -hmm. Different food on weekends. Okay. That was it. Okay, great. Thank you, Jasmine. Let's see, next one. Let's see, um, Joshua. Who did you work with? Uh, with Anna Ruth. Okay, so tell me about Anna Ruth's um, weekend. Uh, she make, make a dress. She made a dress? Uh, she address mm -hmm. uh, she visit uh, her parents all right había una más pero no la copié okay that's fine don't worry all right thank you Joshua for sharing now let me hear let's see Mauricio who did you work with Mauricio, your microphone. Sorry. It's okay. I work it, I work it with Noemi and Lorena. Okay, so tell me about their weekends. Uh, okay, Lorena 
Uh, Lorena, uh, look, she went to Compre de San Bartolo and she washes a, the car or your car. Mm -hmm. uh, and Noemi, she went to buy at the Dollar City a, a, a colored paper and both colored paper. She bought colored paper. Okay. Mm, and she worked in the platform too. Uh, and washed the car too. <laughs> okay, that's nice. Excellent. Thank you, Mauricio. And okay, one last person. That's going to be Karen. Karen, who was your pair? Uh, my pair uh, was Roberto Jimenez and Laura. Okay, so tell us about mm -hmm. their weekends. Okay, uh, Roberto uh, went to the park with his dog, and I don't remember. Uh, uh, Laura, uh, uh, she she took a shower, and uh, she go she went to a restaurant to dinner. Uh, I don't remember more. <laughs> All right, that's it. Very good. Thank you, Karen. Okay, pretty well. Just a couple of things I heard um, while I was visiting the, the rooms. So um, first of all, how to say eh, que más, right? How do we say that in English? What else? Como preguntamos, que más? Or algo más, what else? What else? What else? What else? Um, yes, let me just um, write it over here. Like this. What else? What else? And then also, um, how do we say solamente or solo eso? Only that. Right? Only that. And another thing I hear, oh, eh, solo eso, right? Cuando termina y ya dice, bueno, pues solo eso, right? O solamente. That's it. That's it. That's it. Like, That's eso it. es todo, right? That's it. What else? Only that. That's it. And then some other that expressions it. that we may use when we are talking about um, one of our days. Well, first of all, for the days of the week, we use on. So we say on Sunday, on Monday, on Tuesday, on Thursday, on. La preposición para hablar de los días de la semana, on. On Friday, on, yes. on Saturday. And also, um, you say, I went to, I went to Huachapan, I went to um, San Salvador, I went to Santa Ana. You're like, ah, right? I went to. Oh, and goodness. let's see. Also, the expressions for the times of the day. We have in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. And for night, we use at, at night. So we say in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, at night. Para night usamos at, at night. Okay? And if I say algo más, eh, how do you say? Something more. Um, like this. What else? What else? Uh, okay. 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 All right. Any other questions? Para, para la noche at night mm -hmm. o oh, at the night. At night. Just at night. At okay. night. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the difference when, you use, when we use evening or night? Oh, yeah. So we usually say that night is very late, almost when you go to sleep. For example, okay. here, when we come to the class, we usually say good evening, right? Good evening. Mm -hmm. But then when we say bye at the end of the class, we say good night because it's time to sleep. Good it's night. late, okay? Okay. 
Any other questions? That's it. All right. Okay. <laughs> so now let's talk about the negative. So you know that we use the auxiliary did not or didn't. And um, we should keep the verb in the base form, right? That is in the present. For example, in the sentence, they did not watch a movie. Lorena, can you help me to read the next one? We didn't have enough time. Nice. Carla Maria, help me please. I didn't bring my cell phone. Thank you. And the last one, Laura. Jim did not buy an hamburger. Thank you. Okay, so we use did not or didn't. And then the verb is always in the base form, in the present. Watch, have, bring, buy. Recordemos, en el negativo utilizamos el auxiliar did con el not, que en su forma contractada puede ser didn't. Y luego el verbo no lo cambiamos, lo utilizamos en su base form en el presente. No necesita decir they did not watch, right? They did not watch, watch. Or we didn't have. It isn't we didn't have, right? Uh -uh. We didn't have. We didn't have enough time. I didn't bring, bring. Jim did not buy, okay? So always keep that in mind. We use the verb in the base form, in the present. All right, here I have some practice. We have some sentences. In the affirmative form, we are going to change them to the negative. For example, for this, we are going to use the chat. So please open your chat staff. And we are going to change them like this. Number one, they went to the cinema. So what's the negative for that one? They didn't went to the cinema. They didn't went. Go, go, go right? Go. Uh -huh. Exactly. They didn't the go, go to the cinema. the cinema. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. We are going to change them. We just write them in the chat and we send them. Just remember, we start the sentence with a capital letter and at the end of the sentence, we need a period. Una vez más, al inicio, necesitamos una mayúscula, al final un puntito. So let's see, number two, Ana Ruth. Kate's parents stayed at home. Write it, please. Number three, Karen, I fell down at the park. No, I don't know, teacher. Oh, okay. Don't worry. Let's see. Lorena, can you give it a try? Number three? She didn't fall down at the park. Yes. Can you write it in the chat, please? Okay. Thank you. And Ana Ruth, you're working with number two, right? Es que la, no me tira la, ¿cómo se llama? The, the chat. Oh, the apostrophe. Um, just great, did not. Okay, very good, Lorena. I didn't fall down at the park. Excellent, Ana Ruth. Kate's parents didn't stay at home. Very good. Next one, Jasmine, number four. She got a new car. And number five is for Isabel. Isabel, we drank lemonade to celebrate the victory. Very 
Very good, Jasmine. Okay. She didn't get a new car. Nice. And Isabel? Let's see, Noemi, can you change number six, please? He studied chemistry at the university. Okay, so Noemi says he didn't study chemistry at the university. Excellent, Noemi. Next one, let's see. Carla Maria, we are in number, let's see, seven. John lived in Bloomington for three years. Carla? Okay, eh, la escribo o la digo? Write it, please. John didn't live in Bloomington for three years. Very good. Okay, John didn't live. Excellent. Didn't live, okay. Mauricio, can you work with number eight, please? I ate seafood yesterday. Joshua, you work with number nine. We really enjoyed our last vacation. So Isabel says we didn't drink lemonade to celebrate. Okay, very good, Isabel. We didn't drink. So we're just waiting for Mauricio and Joshua. And the last one is for Roberto. Roberto, you work with number 10. That is, you came to my house last Thursday. Okay. Hey, mira tu teléfono. Mira tu teléfono. Sorry. It's okay. Sorry, sir. Okay, so we have for number eight, I didn't eat seafood yesterday, right? I didn't eat. Number nine, we didn't really enjoy. In this case, because we are using really, we do it this way. We didn't really enjoy our last vacation. And the last one would be, you didn't come to my house last Thursday. Any question? Very good, Joshua. Just change the order with really, right? We didn't really. We say we didn't really enjoy our last vacation. Very good, Mauricio. Okay, any questions? Is it clear? Thank you, Roberto. That's fine. You didn't come to my house last Thursday. Okay, so let's move on. Now let's remember about the yes, no questions. So we have um, that for the yes, no questions, we use the auxiliary did. Then we add the subject, right? Remember that in the case of questions, we always change the order, right? We do not start with the subject, we start with the auxiliary then we need the subject. And remember to keep the verb in the base form, in the present. For example, in the question, did you visit your family last week? Did you visit your family last weekend? Or did your brother call you yesterday? Did your brother call you yesterday? Or did your mom cook for you last week? Did your mom cook for you last week? 
Okay, so now we are going to do an activity. I need you to get a pencil and some paper or a notebook. Si podemos conseguir eh, papel, un lápiz o lapicero, it would be a pen or pencil. We are going to listen and we are going to write the activities. So maybe you have already listened to this video. It talks about summer activities. So let me just play it and you take notes. Van anotando algunas de las actividades que escuchen, okay? All right, let's see. Summer activities. Can you hear that? Yes. Okay, yes. good. So please write the activities. Go hiking. Go swimming. Have fun. Have a picnic. Meet new people. Meet old friends. Play tennis. Play volleyball. See a movie. See a play. Take a class. Take pictures. Now okay, did you get them? Some, someone too fast. <laughs> oh, yes. they go too fast. Okay, let me play it one more time and I'm going to be pausing it. Okay, let's see. Activities go hiking, go swimming. Have fun, have a picnic. Meet new people. Meet old friends. Play tennis. Play volleyball. See a movie. See a play. Take a class. Take pictures. Okay. Could you get more this time? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I got All it. All right. Pretty good. So let's see. What activities did you get? Go swimming. Go hiking. Go swimming. Go hiking. Have fun. Uh, have fun. Have a picnic. Okay. Have a picnic. Meet new people. And all friends. Play people. tennis. Play, tennis. tennis. Play take volleyball. A class. Take a picture. Play, take a, cl a class. Play. Play. See a movie. See a movie. Take a picture. See a play. All right. Play a volleyball. Play volleyball. Very good. So here I have the list. We got... Go hiking. Go hiking. What's the meaning so, of go hiking? Caminata. Yes. Ir a una caminata, right? Go yes. hiking. Go hiking. Then we have go swimming. Okay. Go swimming. Nadar. 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 Exactly. Have fun. Have fun. Divertirse. Divertirse. Yes. Fun. Have a picnic. A picnic. Yes. Next one is meet new people. Excellent. Meet old friends. Okay. Encontrar o reunirse. Reunirse, sí. Yes. Um, next one would be play tennis. Jugar tennis. Then we have play volleyball. Play volleyball. Okay, next one is see a movie. Exactly. See a play. What is that? Not really. A play would be, for example, when you go. Tocar una guitarra, no? No. No. 
In this case, with the word play, we mean um, like when we go to the theater, we see a play. At the theater, we see plays. Sería ver una obra. Ver un juego. Como una ver obra, juego. no. No nos confundamos porque es la palabra play, pero no se refiere a juego, se refiere a una obra de teatro. You see a play. Ok. ¿Y cuál es la diferencia de, de juego con obra de teatro? Eh, juego sería... Eh, the game. The games. Game, ajá. Uh -huh. Or in the case of a soccer match, right? We say soccer match. Hay distintos nombres para decir juego, dependiendo de lo que, del tipo de juego del que esté hablando, ¿verdad? Y es un juego de fútbol, teacher. Soccer match. That would be a soccer uh, match. No es soccer play. Uh, no. Soccer uh, match, we say. Un partido, match. right? Soccer match. Match es como pareja o algo así, Or, ¿no? Yes. Yeah, it could also mean that. <laughs> sí, es que lo, es que lo pensamos en español, por eso no. no. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. So, um, yeah, that could be a soccer match or a soccer game even. Es menos común, pero sí se le puede llamar también game. Uh -huh. So, usually when we talk about sports, we say the word match. Con los deportes, okay. la mayoría match. los manejamos como match, que sería como un partido, match. ¿verdad? Un sí. juego. Uh -huh. Un encuentro. Exactly. Thank you. Ok. Thank so, you. let's continue. The next expression is take a class. You already know what that is, right? Take a class. Take. And at last we have take pictures. Take pictures. Any oh questions? Board. Is it clear? So clear. clear. Okay, just before we go, let's repeat. Go hiking. Go, go hiking. Go hiking. Go swimming. Go, go swimming. swimming. Have fun. Have, Have fun. fun. Have fun. Have a picnic. Have, Have a, a picnic. picnic. Meet new people. Meet, Meet, new, Meet new, new people. people. Meet old friends. Meet all friends. friends. Play tennis. Play, Play tennis. tennis. Play volleyball. Play, Play volleyball. volleyball. See a movie. See a movie. See a movie. movie. See a play. See a play. Take a class. Take pictures. Take pictures. Okay. So that's it for today's class. Thanks for your attention. Take care. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Good night, everybody. 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 everybody.